is a WBA middleweight championship fight. Persona todo el tiempo, protect yourself at all times. Protegete y durante la pelea todo el tiempo. Good luck to both teams. Lara has been around, as we said, for a long, long time. But along with Rolly Romero making some noise with his... He hasn't fought a lefty, O'Sullivan, since 2003. We'll see. Well, you know, <laughs> of course, uh, with Lara uh, right now, he's not moving like he usually moves. Yeah. But he's just quick with his hands. Yeah. yeah I think he's Effective punches. And, you know, he's, he may not be as quick on... And, and throws power punches like he does right there. Yeah. First round. Yeah, but even then, he's... That his last fight where he knocked out Thomas Lamana in the... And they all did it with left hooks. And Brian Castaño... Mm. So punch, you know, not constantly, but with, against yeah. those fighters. Fighter. To give yourself a chance, mm -hmm. you've got to get in course. position to throw. Effective is another question. Watch your head. Head to head with O'Sullivan. Good shot to this. Uh, and he's now in the center of the ring where he's uh, back. The double left hook, he tried that two or three to win in the second round. We're going 12, remember. Punch numbers go down. Against the lesser fighters, he's very busy. Yes. And you know... Uh, and he can't finish the job. He stopped him in the fourth round. So he's gotten some calls. Wrigley knocked him out. Remember yep. Antoine Davis, who was a rising... Andy Lara, going all the way back to when he fought Jared Hurd. Uh, and so, oh, Sullivan not doing it. We've seen that in other fights. And already a little reddening on the face. Start countering more. He is, he has been, but a lot more. Give him Good up. body shot from Sullivan, but... Sullivan right there seconds ago. I would like to see an uppercut. Favorite fighter. There she is. Good for you, young lady. O'Sullivan continuing to try to work the body, maybe try to... Yeah, he's pushing those punches a little bit. O'Sullivan. Oh. And when he throws that left hook to the body, he's got it in two rounds. Uh, that is not going to get... Just saw in a great fight against uh, Jamel Charles. That's exactly it. A, a, a much higher... Not letting his hands go as much. I, th I think it's a little bit too... He's worried about that... And you know, Lara and Sullivan, not really. And nice. you see why. And tonight he's landing 49% of the fighters that uh, show stats tracks. Uppercut from way back. <laughs> I mean, he's able to wind up that. Uh, Just from O'Sullivan. You know, O'Sullivan can land the left to the bottom. Since he's not coming up with anything, there it is. I mean, a very good job and landed power punches. It's the most competitive round O'Sullivan has had in the fight, even though... Got to step back, take a deep breath as well. All right, not a boxing star quite yet. Not popular with this. Uh, he's a big boxing fan. And there's a guy, you know. Meanwhile, back to the act. Mustache is... It's <laughs> perfect. It's very perfect. <laughs> O'Sullivan's face is all marked up, but it's... it's <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Good left hand. Him for all these years. Good left hand right there. Jamal Charlo, and he said, you know, he he taught them, and 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 uh, me too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and one thing's getting older, and Gino just o ring. I'm, you know, but still, you know, really responsibly good fighter in the inside. Yeah, we saw the change. Well, O'Sullivan is trying, but with yes. very little success. And the loss to Hurd in great fights, uh, and in those fights, fought very well. His power punch is the non oh, oh, oh. there, and he drops! Step over here. And watch him now. Put the left hand short at the bell. Uh, okay. Now, as we said, coming into this fight, that was going to be his big... Right away here. That was Packy Collins, the brother's full man, can squeeze out some more rounds here. But really, in, in this type of fight, you kind of sense that it yeah. hurts someone, and he, he's not the aggressive one. Yeah, you know, it's a, a, a fight is a flowing river. The idea that Sullivan's power has not bothered him in this. He's got a 4-3-2 record, but that could be easily be different. Well, he's fought nine, current or four. his attention. Did I say you could fight for five more years? He's about 52, so. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, a good show. fights, you know, where, well, again, you know, it's, it's the fighter. It's... Lara still being very patient. Left. And the interesting is, and you. And that's what I'm talking about, protecting your craft from Lara. He's really.
Mm. Left hand again. Make the difference. And it has for luck. Some nice combinations. They're just not getting through. There's a little time into the ropes. At the end of that round, I mean, he was taking. Lars Lara had some big moments. Landing this. His best. Yeah, now that last left, but, but I don't think it hurt him. But it, at least. It, it, these punches woke up with Sullivan. Or... Safe when he's literally right on the, the chest. Ah! Right on cue. Uh, uh. <laughs> this range. Uh, there it was. <laughs> yeah, especially if you have a. The interesting thing is though, Sullivan's trying to uppercut his yeah. straight left hand. And some jabs from Lara, so Sullivan has thrown more punches than Lara. Straight left. Body shot. Nice yeah. little uppercut. Yeah, did. Oh my, another one. And then bring it to the head. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it, the, back into the ropes that time. Now Lara with it. Because he's not able to. Five seconds, that's a good one. Oh, all the way top to the body. Well, the reason is because O'Sullivan was able to get some shot. Seven weeks, you think that's good? I Arnold is with us, Steve. Uh, they, I think I know. It's a nightmare for judges to score because of all the movement. 950. All right, thanks. And let his hands go. You know, something. you'll be a lot more. That fight on Showtime, you know, people felt if he had just done 12 rounders, Spike O'Sullivan is one and one in 12 rounds. Well, Lara is 6'3". Push him back. He needs to get back in that. Change that. He's certainly hurt O'Sullivan before, but I, I was going to say that, Barry. You know, it, he ah. There's a good left hand that hurt him. That the straight left. I mean, Lara has a real. In, one, in the other round where he was knocked down right at the end of the. So look. Yeah. Who's winning? Who's winning? Of course, either the referee or the doctor could stop first knockdown. I agree. Oh, so. oh. And there, that backs so Sullivan up, and that's it. Most Sullivan, and that was appropriate. But His body Sullivan. language uh, when he got hurt is bruised and battered, except for the mustache. 23 seconds in round number eight. A referee in charge, Benji Estevez, stops the contest. He is the winner by way of technical knockout and still the WBA middleweight champion of the world, Edis Lundy, the American dream, Lara.